All right, folks. Well, the last time I played one of these Dune maps, uh, Paul Atreides became uh, Moadib. So we're checking out number two, Arrakis, second of five maps in the Dune map pack. What is up? Risk takers. Welcome to the Kill Pete strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in Risk Global Domination. The daily release on YouTube. I do weekday streams on Twitch. And if you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels. Come along the ride with me. All right, we're looking at map two of five in the new Dune map pack. This is Arrakis. Uh, first things you want to see, we have uh, four bonus, three territory plus two, four territory plus two, two territory plus two, plus one, interesting. Uh, three territory plus two, three, four, four in the middle. Okay, we go last. So we need to figure out who wants to be where, and we're playing as orange. Um, so it looks like bottom left is our bonus. It's a two. That sucks, but we actually have an okay line to go hua hua, assuming that, does the two connect? Yes, it does. Okay, so, hmm. yeah, I think just camping for bottom left and expanding out maybe into this position, when and if is the play. Okay, red doesn't add to the four, which I like. Plus two into plus two. We go last, we get a bunch of troops. Maybe that'll work in our favor as well. This two actually hooks all the way around. I'm gonna use that and get it out. I'm all in on bottom left with this spawn. Yes. Okay, blue takes a plus one. Hopefully giving red a road out that way. So my, my points of defense will be one, two, three, four, like that, after we take this uh, two bonus plus four. We won't break blue there. Red's kind of fucked though. They're kind of pinned in, at least with that four stack. So I might have a, I might have a challenge getting this off of off of red or getting red out of there. But I'm already only pretty much in one position, so we're just going to accept it and <coughs> play that spawn as it lies. Um, green is going to be top right. Middle top right, yellow's true top right, blue is bottom right. See where green goes. Does green have a bonus to take? Minor egg hitting a four. Gonna hit, yeah, he's gonna hit four, two, and one, isn't he? No, he's gonna take Haga Imperial. Yeah, that's where everyone's gonna be trading cards, so I don't think that holds. Okay, cool. Am I enough troops to hit two threes? A way cheaper bonus than me. Hmm. Okay, I can do it this way. Two pops me. Behind. All right, one, two, three. Let's just get 100% rolls Start with that. Yeah. Get multiple 7v3s is fine. Actually, giving Red a chance to move out is probably wise. And we'll move the two out of the top left into a, into a guarded position. So I have a really, really strong plus two in my open. Um, white isn't breaking. Nobody breaking the green plus four will be very interesting. I figure that gets broken. It's too big an open. Does he take the bonus for himself? Right, he takes the bonus for himself. That's not what I wanted to see. I wanted to see you leave. That's why I'm... I moved this way. I think I definitely steal that. Oh, and he knocks me out of the top pocket. Now I even more definitely steal it. He hits an unnecessary two. <laughs> if I was on the fence about stealing your plus, okay, here's here's a here's a diplomatic um, tactic for you guys, folks. So 
Red wants to take a plus two that's next to my plus two, okay? This says to me, all right, I have two choices. Either I can be a good neighbor or not. And if not, do I break? Well, if I break, I might as well steal. Now, if I steal, which is what I wanted anyways, I'm going to have a player in red who is not favorable to me. But red hitting my two after they've already taken a bonus, taken a card, and it's a two. It's not a one, right? It's an additional ancillary attack that they did not need to do on a different part of the board that was against me. There's absolutely no reason for me to worry about them being my friend or not anymore. So now I 100% steal, right? So what Red did by hitting a two, which is so innocuous, right? What Red did by hitting a two is they ensured that I steal their bonus. I am shocked that we don't see, um, that we do see green hold rather. Okay, people are expanding. Uh, so blue now has plus two and plus one. Yellow now has plus five. Green's card options are somewhat limited. Red can't actually hit me is the thing, right? I'm going to add all to my five. Go pop pop. And I don't have any extra fronts. I have the same number of fronts I'm guarding. We do get 100% roll. We don't get 100% roll there, but I'm sure... Yeah, it works. And... There. Okay, so I have a four. Just in case somehow this gets broken, I still probably hold my bonuses. Okay, white isn't bringing anybody. This map is small, eh? I hope they're not all small. Four plus four plus six plus seven plus seven plus seven. 36 territories, yeah. I hope they're not all small. Small maps are less interesting overall for ranked, for um, world dom, progressive. This map's cool for a small fixed game for less than six players. I want more big maps, right? I want to see massive wars, right? Nine players, ten players. Blue's going to take that card. Okay. And tries to break green but fails. That was unwise. Stacks a nine on me. Huh. I won't have a cheap card, will I? These two connect? Yeah. Yellow should put more material on top left. Does yellow take their card on me? I can trade with yellow outside of their bonus. That would be good. No, he's going to break green. green. See, this is why I was figuring green gets fucked. Yeah. It's not a good bonus to take, right? You're just surrounded by the entire board. And now that I broke, uh, rather stole from red, I might as well keep going. Now red's not there. Really shouldn't hit that too. <laughs> really shouldn't hit that too, sir. Okay, white steps out of the way, maybe allowing red in. Red has a set, I can face retaliation. Maybe he sues out.
Doesn't. Okay. We're going to lose red first. Blue sets early. I think he breaks me. I hope he doesn't. Let's go for the red kill. Yeah, that's what I was figuring. Bottom right. How are we doing for cards? That hits my six, I'm pretty sure. Ah, uh, come on, blue. <sighs> Stay of execution. And well, now I don't stack up on him. Now I stack up here. So when I do get broke, do these connect? Do we still know? Do these two territories actually connect each other? I'm going to need to find that out. <laughs> okay, well, my only real card is in this front with red that's brewing. So I think we put all of our troops up there. I'm going to lock my stack here. Now, I really often recommend people don't do that. Uh, a couple things, though. I expect white opens it, or red opens it, or both. And also, I don't want to be in the early, of the early players killed. We do have a set on four. We're going to start to see, I think we see red set here. Maybe sue me out before he quits the game. Okay, red goes to five cards. I kill red. He doesn't, unless he doesn't open my one. So now my one has to get open or else I can't make that kill. See, I fucked myself. Huh. Now I think it's less likely that blue breaks me because now I, I've, I haven't added here. So there's no additional pressure. Blue sees my troops pointed in, in entirely different directions. So I can go like this and they can go like this, and then we will meet up at the top after everyone else is dead. Yeah, they don't connect. So um, this Harg Pass does not touch Minor Erg South. Also, his 15 is now locked to anyone except for me, which is scary. That means he's not trying to make kills on anyone who isn't me. I think we set kill red here. Okay, yellow sets early. Does yellow go for the red kill? I think they do. This looks like they're going for red. And I am correct. Okay, we lose red. Smell you later. Sh definitely shouldn't have hit my two. Uh, he sets now and gets the eight as well. Uh, sorry, is it the sixth? It is the eight. Okay, we get the eight. You take out the blue exteriors, you return to his position. See, my stack is open again. We lost red. We didn't get the cards. That's fine. White is on five cards for 23. Can I kill white? Is that kill white set? Is that on the table? I think it is. I think it is. Okay, green sets. Now it definitely is. Who broke green? Blue attempted. Who's green pissed at? Maybe green goes for the white kill here. Green also maybe has the white kill. Um, also, their bonus was broken again by yellow. I think that bonus is a trap. Okay, that doesn't look good. That looks like it's going into me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> for no fucking reason. Oh, he, it's not for a reason. He thinks he has my kill. Oh, interesting. Does he have it? He does have my kill. Okay, we get second last. Yep. 
And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Second map in the Dune map pack. We are not. We're not the quiz ads had Iraq folks. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. High skill lobby. Good job guys. Uh, who killed me green? Yeah. Uh, blue was kind of a beginner. Interesting. Very high school lobby. Look at that. Uh, one beginner, one intermediate, one expert, two masters. Hope you enjoyed folks. Uh, hope you found it fun and entertaining, maybe even a little bit educational and informative. If you are interested in getting better at the game for us, I invite you to subscribe to my channels. Come along the ride with me. I'm going to do a first look on all of these Dune maps, and that is number two of five. So hope you enjoyed. Until next time, for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.